Here we go again. something but not actually had the money then this video is for you have it today huh yours today sold what shall i start the paperwork so will i actually own it not for 156 weeks but tomorrow when you're laying on it it'll feel like you own it awesome Often, rent or lease to own furniture and appliance stores market to people with low income. With no money down and no credit checks, these stores make it easy for people with limited money to buy things they wouldn't otherwise be able to afford. No money down, eh? That is my specialty. Is it new? I prefer to call it previously enjoyed. So how much for this hawk? $12 a week and a one-time processing fee. Hmm. So no money down, no credit check, low weekly payment, and I can have it today? I've got a good feeling about this. The convenience and initial reward of walking out of a store with a large item can come at a high cost. Even though the weekly payment may seem low when you're just talking about it in the store, you may not feel the same way 156 weeks later. how many years 156 weeks is? Or that 29% interest could cost you hundreds or even thousands of dollars? Instant gratification feels great, but sometimes you just can't afford it. Sir? 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 Do you want to see the contract? This is our standard lease-to-own contract. I like the way this sounds. Where do I sign? Always read your contracts before you sign them. All the details of your lease-to-own agreement will be in there including penalties for late payments and the return policy. I can end up paying two to $3,000 for a $900 couch. Hey, no deal. If you really want to make a large household purchase and don't have the money, consider if you really need the item. With high interest rates and difficult payment schedules, many people regret making lease or rent-to-own purchases soon after the happy glow of the new purchase is gone. 